Hello there, YouTube. I am Necrostevo. I have been summoned to the battlefield to prove the power of the darkness. The Victorian shadows are back. One Z Bennett came to my DMs with the requisite amount of souls to unlock the darker side of the Pokemon Premier League. So, for season two, I am here. I am inevitable, and I have a capture card. This time, I'm getting back in touch with my demons. Prepare for a circle of delightfully dreadful draft content. These two diabolical hands are composed of ten terrible digits. These are spirit fingers. Of dastardly design, ready to click buttons and bring the pain to every opponent we encounter. I know you're all ready to see the agents of chaos helping me this season. But first, let me explain. I was last of the draft order, and the downside of going on for so long without being on the battlefield means that I get a wheel pick of terror. So, I get two picks at a time in exchange for 17 coaches getting to go ahead of me each time. We were given 120 points on this Sanguine Summoning Circle to build a team of 10 to 12 Pokemon. But what is the use of planning when my pick comes after all those coaches get their blessings? I have to kind of go chaotic, and to that end, I need Hellfire. 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 My first two picks are Torkoal and Walking Wake. The Hellfire that I desire and the devastating wake that I leave shall be the cornerstone of this draft. I care not for the shiny new toys of DLC 2 and anything in the top three to four picks. Um, those, those are all gone, everything is gone. So, allow me to check the forecast. It looks like pain. pain. The backbone of every assault requires reinforcement with vitamins, minerals, and lots of juice. So, I choose the juice dripping from Galarian Slowking Shelterhead. Hmm. Between it and Clefable, I get a defensive core that can set up, provide trick room support, provide stealth rock, toxic spikes, a myriad of traps, poison, and suffering, suffering for anyone who is up against it. The best way to capture the power of the Banshee is to draft a worm and a titan. I don't need to have a Klondike bar to show how well the titan pairs with the chilly reception of Slowking or the fairy dragon Iron Maiden core that I have wrought. No shed this tell is allowed is though, of the so we will not be seeing that type of bloodshed during this future presentation of the Season 2 of the Pokemon Premier League. After drafting so many defensively oriented objects of destruction, it's time to pivot. Do you smell that? It smells of Rafflesia, and I want to feel this way forever. So. We have now drafted Venusaur and Terrakion. Venusaur is here to take advantage of the weather and provide a possible defensive pivot outside of weather, forming a spectacular fire, water, grass core alongside Torkoal and Walking Wake. Terrakion is here to force my opponents to weather the onslaught of physical attacks. If opponents think that they can bring in their fire or water types, to stop my offense or take advantage of my son will leave their soul sore on the floor and racked with eons of regret. I hear what you're saying. Uh, Necro, the, the team is too slow. If you don't bring weather each time, how are you going to clean up in this league? And my answer to that, <laughs> dearest Billion, you, you is you me, Bill. I drafted Crook, Godial, and Mouseholt. Watch as they tidy up this battlefield with impressive speed 
and surprising power. Behold, as the one Pokemon with built-in sunglasses rims and tears the intimidation and ruination. With Mouthhold, the plague is back, and it had kids. My final two picks to round out my forces are now revealed as Dodria and Zephstrika. Again, notable speed tiers, fantastic spammable offensive types. My opponents are going to have to go on a safari in the savannah to get their battle plans right. Finally, I had to select some Terra captains. With only 28 points, I could either pick up Titan, who has 20 points, and one other Pokemon, or Terra Earthworm, who was 14 points and two more. I chose the Terra Captain Orthworm, Dodrio, and Zepstrika. With Orthworm, he will have access to Steel, Ghost, and Fairy. Dodrio will have Flying, Fighting, and Grass. And Zepstrika will have Electric, Ice, and Fire. Why use gas when I get 1 million miles to the soul? This is all the Terra power that I need. So thank you so much for tuning in today. That is our horrific horde. Join the Victorian Shadows as we chronicle the Necronomadex by taking as many souls as we can in Season 2 of the Pokemon Premier League. I would like to give some special thanks. Up first, thank you so much, Gray, for the amazing graphics that I used in this video. Fantastic job with everything there. I also want to thank Stariana for helping me with editing throughout the season. That is not the last time you will hear her name. And also thank you in advance for any art and background that you helped me create for the season. My co-coaches in the back room are Icky Sprite, Pea Kingdom, and of course, Chewy. Thank you all so much for helping me with drafting, set building, team building. It's going to be a great season. And really you can summon a lot more power when you have more people around you. So thank you all so much for your help. And thank you, Pokemon Premier League, for having me this season.